According to the Federal Highway Administration, around 200,000 crashes occur annually due to icing on the roads, which unfortunately results in 800 deaths per year, just in the United States alone. Icing on cars in cold winters can be troublesome for people living in cold areas. It can also lead to the collapse of poles and towers. Icing in air conditioners can significantly drop the heat transfer rate, leading to inefficient operation of the systems. Furthermore, icing on aircrafts can have catastrophic consequences. At the University of Houston's Cullen College of Engineering, the Nanotherm Research Group is leading an initiative to develop a surface that is resistant to ice formation. Despite this wider role of anti-icing surfaces, development of these surfaces remain elusive. Here we have developed a new paradigm and new type of anti-icing surface that outperform other state-of-the-art technologies. These surfaces that are called magnetic slipper surfaces, or in abbreviation MAGS, have ice formation temperature of minus 34 degrees C, and most importantly, ice adhesion strengths of 2 Pascal, while for other state-of-the-art technology, this adhesion strength is 100 kPa, five orders of magnitudes higher. The ice adhesion strength on these surfaces is so small that even by tilting of a surface, ice will be detached from the surface. We envision that these surfaces open new paths for technologies of anti-icing and provide comfort for the people living in the cold climates. Consider a copper plate that is placed on a cold surface. If we allow water droplets to freeze on the copper, the ice that forms proves to be very difficult to remove. Even after forcefully scraping at the copper plate for several minutes, we are unable to completely remove all the ice that forms. But what happens if we are to construct a new surface using the same copper plate but instead putting a magnet underneath and allowing ferrofluid to spread on top? When we place water droplets on the top of the ferrofluid and allow them to freeze, we are able to easily remove the ice, which slides easily on top of the surface with minimal adhesion. In the MAX, the ferrofluid layer is locked on the solid surface by magnetic field. Ferrofluid film prevents the direct contact of the water droplet on the solid surface. Thus, ice is just formed on top of the liquid layer, which has the minimum ice adhesion. This groundbreaking work was published in Nature Communications in November 2016.